We're back with more projects from the community. Yeah, so this is a game with a ton of like hand-drawn artwork, custom sprites. It's also got all these cool transformations, like bear coming out of this dice box. I love all these designs, like this setup with the character in front of a green screen. And then this is an adventure game. And so you've got this little cute cube design exploring the world. I feel like it's got so much personality. And then you've got flowers in the environment around you, also coins to collect and all these different areas to explore. So I'm really loving this project. It's a game maker. So you have your character here and then you're actually dragging out blocks and then the blocks can actually run. So you can see here it's sort of shrinking and changing size and color. Uh, it's really cool. This is a soccer game and it looks really difficult. So what you have to do is you're trying to kick the ball into this basket that seems to be going in a random direction. And I love just the physics, the way the ball zooms around and you have to kick it just right to get it in. And then this is a literal block tutorial. So in an Octo Studio animation, it shows you how you can drag these blocks together. And you can see all these customized block designs, including the icons and everything. I also love to see how the cursor animates. So I've never seen a project quite like this. This is an interactive YouTube video Octo Studio project. You have to follow the key as, as it's moving. And then at the end, there's three options you have to view the next YouTube video that shows you if you're right or wrong. I won't spoil it, but I did check out all three options. So this is a very beautiful scrolling world exploration game. You're kind of moving around the world by tapping right and left and you're collecting wood. And I really love the, the art and the design, the hand-drawn character and the artwork, like the log is really, really cool. And then this is a catching game with a really neat game mechanic. So the stars are zooming along and you have to tap on the location for the octopus to move to as the stars are flying past. So yeah, you really got to time it right to have it hop to the right place. And then this game is without sense. So in the game, you're this character that's jumping around. It's got really fun music. And and the, there are jump blocks falling from the sky and you have to tap those jump blocks for the character to jump. And I love how expressive the character design is. So yeah, thank you to everyone who made projects. Can't wait for the next one.